Well, off to the races once again. Santa Anita Park is back in business following the deaths of nearly two dozen horses since December. And they have some big events coming yeah. up this weekend. You have executives and horse lovers hoping that these changes that they made will end the troubling trend. KCAL 9's Dave Lopez live in Arcadia with a look at how things are going. Dave? Well, so far, things have gone very smoothly. They are right in the middle of uh, race number seven, one of the $200,000 stakes races that had to be postponed because of this nearly one-month-long delay. In fact, I don't know if you can see the horses over my shoulder here, but they are now about ready to get into the stretch run. So, again, uh, nothing like this has ever happened at Santa Anita before. So far, as I mentioned, this is race number seven, not a hitch. After nearly four weeks of controversy, uncertainty, and more questions than answers. Racing returned to Santa Anita today. Is there some nerves about this today? There's excitement. Really? You know, it's, I, we all love racing, we all love horses, and it's great to be back out here and uh, doing what we all love, including the horses. Even after days of testing and retesting and doing everything possible to find some answers, the controversy didn't go away. How many horses died today? Outside the track, a small but very vocal group of protesters demanded that the track be shut down permanently. But racing resumed. And before the first race, were the nerves on edge? No, not really. And they're off. Race one, clean break, everything went smoothly as the crowd looked and watched. And as they say in the racing game, it was a clean trip for every horse. Everything was fabulous. Tracks in great condition, beautiful day. You weren't worried? Not at all. He, not at all. He not might not me. have been, but yeah. A little, little bit of my heart is like, you know, that, that'd be the worst thing to happen right now. The thundering sound of the horses heading down the home stretch. Race after race, the story was the same. No problems? I wanted to keep going like this the rest of the day. It was only day one. But there were absolutely no problems at all. What it happened, it happens. Now we have to look for the, the, the new the new track or whatever and just trying to keep the horses sound enough to keep worried. running. Come on, Seven! And for now, Santa Anita is back. Again, it was a very small crowd here today, but usually they do not draw well. And with them one month off, many people probably didn't think the track was going to reopen. But they're expecting some very big crowds for some very big races. Again, seven races in the books. Everything is going very well right now. And we should mention that of all the horses that have had to be euthanized because of the injuries, not one of those uh, injuries occurred during an actual race. It was all during training. So the track is open, and they're just hoping that uh, it goes as well the rest of the season. Reporting live from Santa Anita, I'm Dave Lopez, Kick on 9 News.